The search continues today for a missing teenager out of Sock County. James Yablonski left his home early Monday morning, and since then, thousands of acres near Devil's Lake State Park have been searched. 27's Rachel Perry joining us live now from that area with more. Rachel, hey, good morning to you. You spoke to Sheriff Chip Meister a little less than an hour ago. Why don't you get us up to speed on what he had to say? Exactly, Mark. Day four, and we're expecting an even larger police presence today. If you remember yesterday, Sheriff Meister said that they requested help from all 72 counties. And if you take a look at this parking lot behind me, we're already seeing dozens of officers on scene. Those agencies began arriving early this morning as we're now looking at more than 72 hours since James went missing. We recently learned a makeshift campsite with some of James's belongings was found just 200 yards from the, where the family van was found. James reportedly left home in that van early Monday morning. The sheriff says the campsite was on the opposite side of the road. Canines picked up his scent nearby but lost it back towards Highway 12. As of today, the sheriff tells me this is still an officer only search and not open to the public after learning a gun was missing from the family's home. This is strictly a law enforcement search right now. There was some information, misinformation that was posted by someone on Facebook. We are not asking for the public at this time by any means. He says they will continue adjusting their search areas in hopes of bringing James home safe and have nine teams out today, about 90 officers in total and 13 K-9 teams. Just a reminder, the sheriff says they do not believe anything suspicious happened at this point. We'll continue updating you throughout the day, but for now, live in Sauk County, Rachel Perry, 27 News.